Suspicious activity reports. The, the key word in that phrase is the word suspicious. There are 170 of those reports, many of them put together by the Treasury Department of our government in the Obama-Biden administration. So 170 of those that the committee has reviewed, thousands of pages of bank records the committee has reviewed, and that has told us that there are now multiple, as Mr. Donalds just said, multiple LLCs receiving money from foreign entities and paying that money out to multiple members of the Biden family. And the fundamental question is the one Byron just raised. For what? What did they do? What was the business? What service did they provide? What value did they add? What did they do to warrant receipt of the money? That is the fundamental question, and no one seems to have an answer to that fundamental question. But Mr. Comer, Chairman Comer, and the team, that's what we're looking into trying to get. And I would just say this too, why not just come clean? Why not just be honest with us? Why not tell us the truth? But I would tell you this, I think it's a pattern with this administration. They haven't been square with us, straight with us, straight with the American people about anything. They, told, they tell us the border is secure. We know it isn't. They tell us our debt ceiling bill is going to hurt veterans. No, it doesn't. Joe Biden said during the campaign that the letter from 51 former intel officials when he used it in the debate, he portrayed it as if it was organic. And we now know through another investigation that we're all working on that, in fact, it was coordinated. That letter from 51 former intel officials was coordinated with the Biden campaign. So much so, the Biden campaign told Mike Morrell, here's the journalist. We want you to have uh, the story to the letter to first. Why not just be straight with us? Why not come clean? Why not tell us the truth? Tell the American people the truth. They deserve that from their government. Again, the fundamental question is, what did they do to warrant the receipt of millions and millions of dollars? Why did, why did Joe Biden's brother, why did Joe Biden's sister-in-law, why did Joe Biden's son, why did so many family members get the money? What did they do to, re to warrant receipt of that money? That's the fundamental question. Chairman Comer and the team have done great work, and they're determined to get answers to those fundamental questions.